hello guys welcome back so now we are going to start work on the drivers app for now we will close our user app so click here on this icon click file and then let's click close project then click on new flutter project and make sure that flutter is selected from here then click next and we will give this name as drivers underscore app okay and here we will say this is uber clone driver app make sure to uncheck windows web mac os linux android and ios we have to only check the other ones are unchecked okay only android ios and then click on the create button So our drivers app is created now as you can see. Now what we need to do is uh, for the time saving as you know that uh, here we also have to implement the registration uh, uh, that is sign up and sign in. So for the time saving what we will do. Let's close this. Okay. File. Let's close this project which is our drivers app. Okay and this user app if you see this button this three dotted button click on that and you will see show in explorer it will show us the location where we have our user app and driver app from the user app go inside the users app and now inside the users app you will see lib inside the lib we have man dot dot so we have to copy the man dot dot okay select man dot dot also we need to copy the widgets and also the authentication so select man widgets and authentication okay and also the global authentication global widgets and man select these files copy it okay and then come back and inside the drivers app we have inside the lib of drivers app okay as you can see inside the drivers app lib folder we can simply paste the files here so click on replace the file in the destination so our main widgets global authentications we paste in here inside the drivers app so now let's just open up our drivers app as you can see this is now our drivers app of course from here uh, first of all we have to add the dependencies quickly and the dependencies will be the same which we use in our users app okay if you go back to the users app inside the prospect.ml file just copy these dependencies okay just copy these dependencies and now we will go back to our drivers app and inside the drivers app popspec.ml file below the cupertino icons we can paste our dependencies okay make sure that it is in proper indentation or you can say proper alignment that is no space forward no space backward for any dependency first add this then the next thing is i will provide these images okay these images just copy these images go back to your project right click on the drivers app new and create a new folder by the name assets and then right click on assets new and create a new folder by the name images so inside the images folder right click on images folder then click paste and click ok so now inside the images folder we have over these images you can see that okay now of course we have to add the path of our this assets images inside the popspec.html so come down here and here we have assets just like this so we have assets and inside the assets folder we have images folder whatever is inside the images folder is that is now the part of our this project just like this okay and then simply click on pub get so it has been added successfully all the dependencies has been added successfully now what we can do is click here on this import and remove this login screen and sign up screen okay which shows the red lines now 
the files which we added inside the lib are authentication global widgets and of course the man dot dot which you see here so our app starts from the login screen so we will go to the login screen dot dot file and from here we will remove these packages which show these red lines errors okay just remove that and then uh, one thing which we need uh, from our user app is the uh, common methods file also so go back to your users app inside the users app lib and from here you can simply copy this methods okay and inside the drivers app in right click on lib and then click paste and then click ok so we have our methods here as you can see okay so now we can simply import the common methods which belongs to methods folder okay common methods dot dot and then the rest of the thing will remain the same as you know this is the login screen now for the driver so we will of course do some changes in the method where we sign in the driver for example after successful authentication we check if the if the driver record exists inside the drivers parent node inside the database okay and then of course the for the driver we will have the same block status which we have to check and if it is not blocked then we will get the driver name however here we do not need to retrieve the name of the driver okay so for now we will comment out this line of code okay just comment out this line of code and then if everything goes successful we will send the user to the main driver app which is our home page of driver app but in case of the driver app it will be it will have different name that is dashboard or the bottom navigation so what we can do is uh, we can create now right click on lib new create a new folder we will give it name as pages right click on pages new dot file and we will give it name as dashboard so inside the pages we have dashboard dashboard dot dot for now uh, we will just create a stateful widget and we will give it name as uh, dashboard and for now we will leave this page empty it has only a placeholder okay so after successful login we will send the user to dashboard and then come down here inside the UI that is first we have image logo from the assets images and then inside the images we have the uberexec.png this file this uh, image this image we will display here as you know this is a driver app so we can say uberexec uberexec.png and then we will say login as a driver and then of course the email so you can say your email or you can say driver email your email your password and then login button so the rest of the thing will remain the same however here if the user click on register here button we will send the user to the sign up screen okay make sure to import sign up screen dot dot so this is all about our sign in for the drivers okay and if no record exists we can say no record exists as a driver since you know it is our driver app so this is all about our login if you go back to the main dot dot make sure to import login screen here okay login screen dot dot so we have implemented the login screen in this video in the next video we will set up the sign up screen
we will work on the sign up screen